What's going on everyone, Mike back with another box break. Today I'm breaking a retail blaster box of 2018 Topps Archives Baseball. Topps Archives Baseball is always one of the products during the course of the year that I really look forward to. This year they actually have a retail and hobby version. I'm not so sure how different they'll be, but the retail version just hit stores and the hobby version will not be out until September. As you can see, this blaster contains seven packs plus two bonus tops coins inside. Retail price is $19.99. Always enjoy Topps Archives. Love the classic designs. Beautiful product. Great for set collectors. Great for binder cards. Stuff like that. There are amazing hits you can get, but they are always pretty tough, pretty difficult. So this year's design... Features 1959 tops, 1977 tops, and 1981 tops. So we'll see how we do out of this little blaster. Just wanted to give it a try. So far from what I've seen, there are blaster boxes and there are the value packs. Not sure if there's anything else coming out or any type of exclusives to any specific stores. I know that when they did release this checklist... Uh, a few days ago, they did specify it was the retail checklist, so I'm assuming there'll be some other hits and things like that that is hobby exclusive. This year, one of the things people will be chasing is those Sandlot movie cards. Definitely a very popular movie. We get the two coins, old style things. Remember these from back in the day. We'll rip these coins first, see if we get anything interesting out of these. Didn't check the checklist, but I'm assuming there's probably one for every team produced. So we start off with a Buster Posey. Nice little coin. Be a little cool little collectible for a Giants fan. And our second one. These things are not the easiest to open. There we go. Second one is actually from the Sandlot. So that's pretty cool. Hamilton Ham Porter, the Sandlot. That's what the back looks like. So a nice little bonus. I'm guessing these will be retail only, but don't know for sure. So those are our two little coins. And now we will start to get into the base packs. Those are pack number one. Cool looking packaging. Dig the uh, the look of the packets, packs for sure. Let's start off with Larry Doby. This always features a checklist of former big leaguers and current guys. Nomar Garcia Parra, Dave Winfield, Jimmy Fox, Chris Sale. We got a purple, Luis Gohara. That is numbered to 175. Got Edgar Martinez and Mark McGuire. So that pack was very heavy with the former players. So let's see what we get out of pack two. I do know that Topps Archives will be the first product where you can pull a Juan Soto rookie card, so that's something to look for. Honus Wagner, Wade Davis, Michael Conforto, Kevin Kiermeyer, Austin Hedges, Dodgers Dynamos, Peterson, Puig, and Kemp. Miguel Andohar rookie, nice one there. And Jose Altuve. Just always beautiful cards. Really, really have fun with Topps Archives. Archives is one of those products that caught my attention years ago and kind of got me, pulled me back towards the hobby. Got our first Sandlot card. Alan Yeah Yeah McLennan, the Sandlot. I'm sure there'll be a lot of people putting together these sets. Yonis Cespedes and Johnny Cueto. Got a few packs left. We got Jordan Hicks. Brian Anderson. There we go. There's a Juan Soto. A little bit rough down at the bottom. Maybe a little bit of centering top to bottom. That's not perfect, but Juan Soto rookie. Brandon Belt, Steven Strasburg, Ricky Henderson, Frank Thomas, and Bob Lemon. So I deem this box a success. Got a Sandlot card, got a Juan Soto, and had some fun checking out a new product. Gary Carter, Will Clark, Brooks Robinson, Whitey Ford, Jim Palmer, Topps Rookie History. It's a little insert set they put together. Alex Bregman, Gary Sanchez, and Yanjervis Salarte. Two packs to go. 
Got a Greg Maddox, Harrison Bader, Jake Lamb, LeMahieu, Corey Kniebel, Aaron Altair, Xander Bogarts, and Alex Gordon. So we're down to the final pack in this blaster of 2018 Topps Archives Baseball. I'll definitely do at least one hobby box when it comes out. Definitely uh, just enjoy the product for sure. Here's a nice one. Angels Future Stars, Shohei Otani, Parker Bridwell, and Troy Schribner. So, very cool to hit an Otani. I think this is an insert set. Yep, Future Stars insert set. Nice Bryce Harper. And Eddie Matthews. So, that's your look at 2018 Topps Archives Baseball. Just wanted to give you a little look at it. Like I said, the... Retail boxes are out now. Hobby boxes should be coming in the next few weeks. And that's a look. Comment below. Let me know what you think of Topps Archives Baseball. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll talk to you next time. Have a great one.